Hi, this is Jack with Dolphy Tech. Just a short video today to take you through the basic functionality of the total focusing method, or TFM, when used with the Dolphy Cam 2. So TFM is a pixel-based reconstruction algorithm that uses synthetic focusing to improve the resolution of ultrasonic data. So with the Dolphy Cam 2, it's applied in the 2B scan views. In front of me today, I have a 10 MHz TRM looking at 5 mm thick aluminium. And we see in the C-scan, so this is the amplitude C-scan, we have two rows of holes um, on the opposite surface of the block. So the top row of holes are flat-bottomed holes of 2, 3 and 6 mm diameter, whereas the bottom row are round-bottomed holes. So looking at the 6 mm diameter ones, we can already see um, some differences between the flat and the round in that the flat bottom hole here is providing a strong reflective surface back to the probe. So it's a higher signal amplitude compared to the back wall, whereas the round bottom hole, because it's curved, there's, there's no clear reflective surface, so it's darker compared to the back wall. Uh, correspondingly, in the vertical B scan here, which is through this line, so perpendicular to the screen, we can see that we have uh, this reflective surface of the flat bottomed hole, whereas for the round bottomed hole, we just have a faint curve. So now to apply TFM, I'm just going to align this as well as I can between the center line of both. I've paused it, pressing the button on the TRM, and now I'm clicking Enable TFM, and we see it reconstruct. So we see immediately we have very nice resolution in our B scans now. I'm um, looking first at the vertical one, so we have very nicely delineated edges of the flat bottom hole, and now that top point of the round bottom hole is providing a nice point reflection here, so we can accurately measure its depth. For the flat bottom holes through the horizontal B scan, so looking at the 2, 3 and 6 millimeter, we can see that the edges of these are nicely delineated, which means that I can come in here with my line measurement tool, and accurately measure the diameters of these through the B scan. So it's very nice using the TFM and really being able to maximize resolution and take measurements from the B scan images as well as in the C scan itself. Thank you very much for watching.